Hey guys, Mad Matt Wanka Wilson here with a uh, another episode of Mad Matt's Minecraft Hardcore. Um, it's been a while since I put up an episode. Um, this isn't the right world. Now that I'm thinking about it, uh, uh, the 1.2 update has come out. Um, so it's added a couple of you know a couple of pretty cool things. Um, things like upside down stairs for building aesthetics. Um, Apparently, it looks like it goofed up this door. Um, let's see here. What else? Um, I don't know. There's new biomes that have been created. Stuff like that. Bunch of really fun, really cool changes. Um, so, gonna have to do those. Um, today, um, I'm not entirely sure what I want to do. Um, I do have this here that I still need to do something with. Um, I don't know, I've got a bunch of resources, uh, talking about mods, let's talk about those real quick, um, I'm probably not going to be using or adding any mods, uh, until they start being available for 1.2, um, so I'm not entirely sure, and some of them, looks like, like the dinosaur one that I wanted to do goes on, like, uh, towards the end, and the, anyway, there's some mods that I'm looking at, we'll see, um, which ones we use, and I need a project, I think I know what project I'm going to do, um, because I saw something on one of Ethos lab videos, uh, about the, um, what's it called, I, he called it the bread maker, I don't know if it's actually received that name yet, but it's a way to automatically make bread, so I'm going to try and, um, make one of those, so, and I won't put it right there, I think I'll put it right, um, oops, squid, I think I'll put it somewhere. I don't know. I'll probably build it underground, maybe. I don't know. We'll see. I have to go see how much we're in it. So I'm going to go do that research now and uh, start gathering up some supplies. So, right. Uh, I will, you know, activate the mystical teleportation device and meet you guys uh, at uh, the building site. Boop! Okay, um, teleported over onto different worlds and stuff, and I made the, um, the bread maker in creative, however, I am going to need some slimes, and I don't have slimes yet, so I'm gonna have to wait till I get, you know, go caving and find some slimes before I can make the bread thing, so I've decided to make a, uh, mob spawny box over here in the ocean, um, so I'm trying to get, uh, and see, it looks like it's pretty fairly simple, the one that I'm going to end up using, um, it's just, um, I don't know how to do it, and I want to kill this guy real quick before he, so I can get experience, yay, I wonder where he came from, I wonder if there's like a cave over here that I've not seen, because I haven't looked around this corner, I better look around this corner, I did go downstairs into the mine for, not the mine, um, into the uh, cave system around here for a little bit, just wasting time before I realized I probably shouldn't do that um, with no camera running and um, mm -hmm, mm -hmm, no real purpose. So, okay, so I guess there isn't like a weird cave here where there can be zombies. Um, I hope you guys are able to see. I found out a bunch of stupid stuff with my recording stuff, pretty much. Um, I will record off of my webcam, because that lets you be able to actually hear things, and it doesn't give you the weird crackly noises that my mic does. Um, so, this should be a little bit better sound quality. Um, oh, the bone. How many of those do I have? One? Yeah, I go and kill two skeletons, and I only have one. There's no justice in the world. Okay, so yeah, and... Um, part, big part of the, uh, bread making machine is that, um, it does need bone meal, which I don't really have, so, um, speed. killing a sheep with a sharpness one blade, so anyway, um, yeah, I'm gonna find, uh, didn't look like there's, there's not a tutorial of it, but, um, uh, I know where you find the instructionals 
on how to make this thing. So, yep, I'm looking into that. Right. Okay. So, I've been doing a bunch off of camera. I suppose I should be making like a boip noise or something. I decided to turn this guy, turn recording back on so you can watch me school Mr. Skellington over here. Or try to, I suppose. Um, looks like I did. Did I get the bone? I didn't get the bone. There's a bone somewhere down here. I want it. There it goes. Okay. Uh, there we go. Okay, so I've been working on that um, mob trap, like I had mentioned. Um, that start healing, and I'm putting it over here. I only got one level of it done, but I figured out how to make it work now. So, um, <laughs> and uh, this is entirely copied off of uh, one of Etho's Let's Plays. Not Let's Plays. Um, their Minecraft server, I think it is. Anyway, what it is, we got 12 spawning platforms here um, and I'll be encasing it with wood and then it'll become dark so mobs will spawn all the time which is you know the point of these things um, anyway uh, with it all the water pushes them to the middle I believe Etho countered out and said that there were 96 uh, spawning spots uh, per level of this and you know ideally um, you go and you make a bunch more levels of it, and you just add on top, and it all just comes just down. So, but, as you can see, it takes up a lot of wood. Um, so, I'll probably end up casing this, uh casing it. I don't know. I'll probably actually leave it open for at least a little bit so I can um, figure out the next level because I don't have it all down yet. It's pretty simple as uh, mob traps go. Just a bunch of spawning platforms. There's a bunch of water be underneath me so that as long as I don't fall next to my ladders like I normally do um, I'm not, you know, if I just jump off into the water uh, I can I'm fine. Got myself an infinite little spring over there. I'll need to remember to bring some ladders up next time. So, yeah. Things spawn here, which means this, if I do that, that means no Endermen can spawn. Creepers. So, creeper zombies and skeletons will spawn, and they'll wander about. Like, yeah, 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 yeah. Oop, I'm in the water. What am I going to do? What am I going to do? <laughs> Splish. Except I won't have a splish there. I'll have more of a speak or something. I don't know. I don't know what I'm doing for the bottom of it yet. I have to count how many squares that is and stuff. And made this walkway that's almost killed me once. So that's my um, thing that I'm gonna use to harvest skeleton bones, so that I can get plenty and plenty of delicious, delicious breads. Yes, maybe I'll find a slime. That'd be sweet. I doubt I will because you know. Slimes are normally underground things, but who knows how they spawn nowadays. So, anyway. I think that's it for me. I was talking with one of my friends at work the other day. It's just from keeping a lot of construction supplies. It takes a lot of wood. So, I've had to do a bunch of that. But anyway, I was talking to one of my friends, and we were talking about awesome mods. Um, we came up with this concept of, uh, you know, a device that builds a castle for you. That you, like, you place it down and just goes, bloop! And poof, there's a castle where blocks used to be. And a special version of it where you could like set it down and hit somebody's bed. Or not well, where it won't break somebody's bed and make a castle there. So I was just thinking of that. Anyway, this is at one cow. I'm gonna have to say uh stay online and I'll see you guys next time. Peace out.